I am so grateful for my students. They have returned from winter break, ready to work. They bring me joy every single day. That's why I do this job. That's the best part about my job is my students. I try to like put myself in their shoes and, and, and try to have empathy for, for what's going on in their life um, or kind of what their goals are. Energy for teaching, um, I, I have to say it, it comes from helping students overcome. Something that makes me happy is that moment when a kid finally gets something. It's that light bulb moment. Um, the other thing that makes me really happy is when I get to work with students who are making life decisions. I mean, we work with high schoolers, so when they make decisions about what they're doing after high school and they get really excited about it, that makes me happy. I get to share in that joy with them. I, I realized I wanted to be a teacher when, uh, in college, I sat in a math class with a gentleman who was absolutely brilliant, but was horrendous at teaching and I ended up teaching everybody around me. And that's when I realized I want to be a math teacher. You know, I went to college as a business major, and in this math class I realized this whole math teaching thing is kind of fun. I was actually in school to be an elementary school teacher, and I discovered that I was like missing deadlines um, as far as, you know, taking them to recess and stuff like that because I would be sitting with them on the carpet reading to them, and, and so my supervisor was like, you know, you might go in the counseling direction. When I started this career path, I thought I would work with younger kids, but then as soon as I did an internship through my college program with high schoolers, I realized this was where it's at. I just enjoy this age group. There's something about teenagers where they're making lifelong decisions and you get to help guide them on that path that I absolutely adore. I work with the best and most loving people and they are about the students and they care about the students um, and it, it's what kind of keeps me coming back. I get my energy definitely from the students but 100% from my colleagues too. We really build each other up. One of the beautiful things about Lafayette High School is this is the most amazing staff I have ever worked with in my life. I almost get choked up but we really do support each other. We genuinely enjoy working together and we just build each other up. In, in education there's always options to go other places and move up in, in administration and, and that sort of thing and um, the day that I come to school and I'm not with students every day just seems like a miserable day. It really, really does, you know, um, and the kids keep me going. The wins, the losses, the struggles, the overcoming, that's what keeps me going. I'm a pretty goofy person, so I kind of, I just, that's kind of what drives me is, is making people happy and seeing them happy it makes me happy. So in my classroom every year, there's a hanger, and um, I try not to have it, but what it comes from is uh, in August, there's back to school night, and during the day, we're here, we have you know PD and meetings, and um, so you're comfortable, but at night, you have back to school night, so I bring dress clothes on a hanger, and every single year for like the past eight years, I don't take the hanger home till May. I'm a huge Disney fanatic. My students probably already know that, but I get a Disney World and I'm one of those people who is at the parks and I'm already going, when's my next Disney vacation? I'm just a huge Disney fanatic. It is truly the happiest place on earth and I love it. For the longest time I played in a band and, uh, and I missed it. So I kind of changed it into an announcing career. So I announce uh, sports, I announce at William & Mary and here at Jamestown. I'm a, an obsessive reader. Like I read all the time. I go through a couple books a week. So I grew up in WJCC schools. I went to Norge, I went to Toronto, I went to Lafayette. Um, so the greatest gift ever is that I get to work with the teachers that inspired me and taught me